Alright everyone, welcome back to Let's Play Mother 3. Last time we checked out Tazmilly. How it's changed a little since we head off to Club Titty Boo. And we fought an optional boss back in Castle Soe. Classical ghost music. But now we're back to find the hummingbird egg. First let's talk to this mole. No, I will not take a look at what you have because he's selling stuff and I need to get my DP out. I think 3,000 should be good. Alright, we're here again. Got some worms. First sell because both Duster and Lucas have a full stack of stuff. That's it for you. I we can give it the durable shoes now. As well as divine declare. Let's see what you have, just for reference. You're okay. Um Yeah, we can get rid of the paper fan too. Anyway, let's start buying. Alright, Lucas has that. What does Lucas have he can wear? Capricorn bracelet. I'm actually not gonna buy one for him. And I'll show you why in just a little bit. Fly, yeah, sharp shoes. The ones we got last time were plus 20 offense for Lucas. That's why you wanna do that, give him a big edge. Fly chart. Let's do that. Yeah, you don't need that anymore. You're not part of the band. Use his bandana as well. But now you will have the Capricorn bracelet. Kurituma. Kumatora. I don't know how I keep getting her name wrong. Fly charm, yes. Very good. Ribbon. Oh yeah. And now a bracelet. Yeah. Finally, a good dog, Boney. We can use. Just a ribbon. Yes. Eh, you don't need that hat. I looked. And now I'm off. Wait, what? I thought I got the advantage. And we're taking extra damage now. Yeah, we're not gonna take this lightly. And you know what? We're just gonna make quick work of these guys. Going to attack with love and thunder. And I'll let Boney sniff him out. Yep. Ow. Not again. <laughs> he didn't suck that a second time. Ow. I have some love power. I think we can just bash the rest of this battle. Yeah, we're taking a lot of hits this fight already. So I think I'm gonna head over to the hot spring. Be right back. Alright, and we're back after fighting them again. Oh yeah, along the way back to the factory, two things happened. One, uh... The button will work. Dust at level 23 from a quick battle in the caves, in the tunnel. And Kumatora, she learned... What is it? Hypnosis. Put an enemy to sleep. Now this is enemy... Uh oh. You don't want to sneak up on the Mecha Turtle from behind. Yeah, let's thunder it. And sniff. Because when you fight it front up, its first move will actually be to turn around to show off all its guns. I mean, just look at the power of that cannon. Yeah, we'll heal that up next turn. I mean, not next turn, I mean out of battle. 
Yeah, that's gonna be good enough. And now we can go back to being a dog. That's right, woof woof. I kinda like you in that hipster dog outfit. Ooh, here we go, this hole will look just like this. But... Oh yeah, there's a hell of a lot more of them now. I guess not. Well, we gotta be right. You actually don't have to go in random. Cause you're all going to the same cave. Moles building dungeons? Actually, more tunnels are more than just places to live. Also, traps to confuse and capture food, such as insects. That was like those little dungeons. Wow. I wonder how true that is. I don't. <laughs> I don't know. Grind the holes. Dig, dig, dig. Lazy, lazy. Okay. That's why we weren't getting a Capricorn bracelet. Because we can just buy one right here. No. Every hole actually leads into this area. Alright, Dusty. So now everyone's fully equipped for this moment. Ow. I think Thunder is good against these guys, but... We're finished, don't worry. See all those circles of light? That's where you come in from dropping in a hole. A pencil rocket. I'm actually going to give that to Boney. So that's a powerful offensive item. You definitely want the dog to have it. I just skipped out. We hardly took any damage. Dig, 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 dig. Sunglasses. Helmets. Yeah, putting them away. Oh my god, where does that helmet come from? You're supposed to be wearing them, bully. Alright, let's do this better this time. Freeze them. Now let's see how good you do it. Will you solidify? No. Machine gun. That's a lot of solo hits, but it's still like zero damage compared to our max health. That's all we needed. Yeah, we're just gonna walk around exploring what little there is to explore. Dig, 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 dig. Some ominous appear to a dream. Oh, you're small. That's because it's the favorite food. Oh yeah, just got clowns, Hinawa. You're digging a hole into the wall inside the hole? That's like a whole section. You're making the world a hole. Nope, we're not lost. <laughs> a complex hole? I don't like that the world gonna be a whole maze. That frightens me. I already talked to you, shut up. Alright, let's see what else. That guy must be new. No, it's the same one. Okay, I just walked around to see if there's anything else on this. Nope, we got everything from this hole. So we come to the bottom, it takes us to the southern edge of this room. But here's where we want to go, the most southwest hole. After digging up this presence. Another dig 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 dig. Trio, trio, trio. It's not sunny, kind of cloudy. It looks sort of nighttimey from this atmosphere. So I don't know why this is like the techno mysterious theme. Take a break. Alright. Let's draw some M and rhymes with hole. Lol. That's too easy. That's too good. H finds a mole. 
Hmm. Cool. Yeah, you're not good at that. That's a nice 30 second break. Last mole, what you gotta say? There's a lazy mole who lived in a hole. The mole would never ever dig on a zoo. So this damn right hole to the others duck and say dig 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 dig. What happened to that mole you ask? Yeah. <laughs> oh, he lived happily ever after. And this will take you back close to where that sign was. Hey, here's a claimant that we hit it in. Looks different from the rest. Score. Yes. Alright. Whoa. More thunder. Didn't Taz really get enough of it? That's good. What else would it be? That was too close. You almost became fried lucky. Uh oh. Clayman's on the move. Hey, he's up and running. <sighs> oh no! We need that egg. Let's do it. Tower of love and peace, stay away. That's a mighty big tower there. Whoa, that's way up high. Oh, I see it. view of the tower from some titty boo. Well, if the opening chapter cutscene is any indicator, thunder comes from it. I mean, the chapter's called Tower of Thunder. Oh yeah, that thing's on a freaking rampage. Yeah, we came all the way from where the center of the screen is, and up all the way over to the top of the corner. It is like this, you can go all the way behind the tower. And there's no, nothing behind there you can examine. That's still pretty neat. I'll show this battle. See how quickly we can destroy it. Come on. Ooh, Bones is gonna need it. Actually, we all could use a little bit of life up. So, Lucas. Do some of your thing. Good. Good. Kumatora, you help out with the life up. Do it for Boney. Okay, I just skipped the Mecha Turtle battles, but Kumatora became level 22. And apparently it's just enough to get them to drop bombs and even be filled in one round. Of the start of two turns. Can the same be said for the Kanga Shark? Anything they get one hit in, and that's it. Alright, come on. A uh, secret herb. I'm gonna show what this says. Kumatora? Yeah, here we are. Just removes all status effects, including capacitation. So basically, it's like the cup of life noodles from Earthbound. Because in that game, the secret herb... Oh, I really needed that. Secret herb only did a handful of status effects it could cure. This time, it does them all. And Bone is level 25 now. I should get that too because we're pretty much just taking these out and instantly. There's nothing special I can say about it. No problem there. Let's see anything around here? Nope. And these vending machines. Yep, this one sells all the items that Mobile Cricket did. And 
this one just has status items. Pork noodles, so it's 80 HP. Don't need it yet. Recollection bell. Hmm, I don't... That seems like it can't be used. Secret herb? Nah. I don't think I'll need it right now. Hey, it's another factory. Claim it factory. Hey, do you take your mask when you go to the bathroom? Now nah, I leave it on. Why, if you take your roads, go throughout in the travel, you're in the bathroom. <laughs> yeah, go through the travel. There is a place to hang it there, after all. It's not. But what if you don't have a bag of umbrella? Yeah. <laughs> We're looking at you, man. Uh-oh, you're afraid of me? So right, this one, please, this all you. Sounds less like an army and like an actual workplace. Sir? Just who the hell do you think I am? Commander? Alright, what we got? That's better. Uh, yeah, thanks. Hmm, Luke is looking pretty nice here. Definitely. You see my edge? Yes, what is it? What do you got for me? We got another secret herb. Alright, our kindness stat went up. Even though it's hidden and does absolutely nothing. Yeah, you got it from the mouse, too. Let's use PK Fire. Yeah, there's a lot of mistake makers around here, isn't there? One more present. Boogie Boogie Rhythm. <laughs> That's a nice beat. Uh, good to be distraction. Ordinary clay. Ando, Antoine, Adamantium, Androgyny. Oh, nuts, I forget. That's a clever reference to Earthbound if you're paying attention. And if you don't, they actually reveal more of it too. Now we can't let it go, it's carrying something. Something that we need. What weird stuff. Yeah. That's what a lot of people low in the command chain will say. They just know what happens, not how it works. Yeah, Pony looks kinda cool with that mask on. It's like a mask wrestler. Which means we can't turn back. I think this was good enough for this part. We'll check out that factory next time. Till then, enjoy the cereal and thanks for watching.